Hey, hey, YouTube, this is Gamer Corey, and welcome back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 online video. And in this video, I want to discuss with you guys what I believe to be the best three, top three ways to make money in Red Dead Online. Now, I know I'm going to get a little controversy, but I also want to know in the comment section what you guys believe to be the top three ways to make money in a red dead online i'd like to know what your guys's opinions are so please leave those down in the comment section so the number one thing that is not going to be in this video is actually going to be showdown now the reason that showdown series are not going to make it into this video it's strictly because you actually don't make that much money by itself playing the showdown series now the one of the last games that i played in showdown series i only made about 15 dollars in a seven minute period now some of the money methods i'm going to show you i can make way more money in a seven minute period and i was actually like in the top 10 and i've definitely gotten mvp before in some of my other videos or some of my other series that i've played and i still only make maybe 25 to 35 dollars per time and that's roughly every 10 minutes or so. So it is not going to be in this video. And I know that I'm going to get probably a lot of opinions that Showdown Series is one of the best ways to make money. And it's the only quote unquote way to make money in the game and playing the game correctly. But these are all in the game. So it, all these options are completely ways of playing the game. Now, one quick thing that I do want you guys to know about is there's actually going to be four methods. Number three actually is tied with two of the money-making methods that I'm going to show you. And there are many places on the map that this can be done. And I'm only going to show you guys video clips of me doing it in my specific areas. And there's lots of other ones out there. Uh, the links will be down in the description. So if you guys want to check out each individual video, definitely feel free to do that as I'm going to give a lot more detailed information in those videos. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into what I believe is the top three. Now, as previously mentioned, there is going to be two money-making methods for the third spot. Now, the first one here is pretty much finding a carcass and feeding it to the fish. Now, the fish will obviously go ahead and be attracted to the carcass if the carcass is placed in the right amount of water and the amount of water that is shallow enough for the fish to be basically be attracted to it. Now, they will just randomly start dying. And the one thing that I really do like about this method is that it's completely AFK if you choose it to be. You could go and do something else for 10 minutes, come back, collect your fish, and move on to something else. Now, the only downfall to something like this is if you are going to be doing something completely afk is that you could still potentially be a target by a griefer and you could lose all these fish and somebody else could completely pick them up so that is one drawback to this method now there are a lot of different areas that this could be done at but i'm halfway between strawberry and valentine right here at the dakota river now you can go ahead and do this either close to Blackwater, and there are several other spots located all throughout Red Dead Online that you can perform this exact same method. Now, by using the carcass method, I was able to make roughly $33 in a 10 to 15 minute range. Not too bad for a money making method. Now for the next money making method. This location is pretty much just straight north of St. Denis, the islands in the swampy area of Lagros. Now in this video, I kill a lot of smaller alligators and a lot of like boars, anything around this area to make some extra money. Now the reason that I am targeting the smaller alligators in this video is because you can actually carry their skins multiple at a, at a time compared to killing a larger alligator. Now your horse can store pretty much unlimited amounts of skins, but you can carry two bird carcasses and one main carcass on the back of your horse when you do sell to the butcher down in St. Denis. Now I was able to make about $60 in a 15 to 20 minute range 
making this slightly better than the first one, but it does take more time. Now, the one thing that I did notice about this specific method is that you weren't always guaranteed to always get the same number of birds or alligators always in the same at the same time frame. There was one time that I did it where I was only able to make about uh, in about a 10 minute period, I was only able to make maybe 15 to 20 bucks because I couldn't find hardly any birds. Now for the next method, we are going to be going south of Tumbleweed, really close to Benedict Point. Now this is a cougar spawn location and the cougar will spawn in the exact same spot every single time. Now the reason that I have this at number two is this method only takes about five minutes or so. Now there are eagles, condors, and turkeys in this area that you can have additional income if you're able to find them. And actually in just a moment, you're gonna see me find a condor that I'm able to add to my horse for that additional profit when we sell this at the bush butcher. Now roughly you're gonna make 20 to $30 every five minutes doing this method and if we do a little bit of quick math with the bird method we're only going to be making about you know we made sixty dollars in about a 15 to 20 minute range but every five minutes if we're making 20 to 30 dollars we're actually going to be making about 80 dollars in that same time frame and that, that was because we had a lot of extra stuff on our horse when we were doing the bird method just north of saint denis I really do like this method. I really suggest that you guys check this cougar location out. Every time that I've done it, there's pretty much been no competition in the area. And if there happens to be competition in that area, just load into a new free roam game because you never have to reload with this specific cougar method. You do it once and you can kind of just continuously do it because every time you go back to that same specific location, the cougar will spawn or respawn by the time that you actually get back down there down there now i definitely suggest that you watch the full video in the description down below just to kind of see the path that i take uh kind of just different options for you but this is a great money making method and it's number two on my list now for the last method which i believe to be the best in red dead online as of right now there might be a better option later but we are going to be fishing for lake sturgeon now this location is right across the street from the butcher in blackwater and we are going to make a ton of money really quickly now using this method i was able to make roughly a hundred dollars in a 15 minute time frame and there's actually videos out there that prove this with this method it is by far the best fishing method hands down in the game and that's as of right now. Now, the only problem with this money-making method is it is located in Blackwater and there are a lot of griefers there. Now, the nice thing about this location is you'll only lose one fish if that happens to you instead of carrying a, a horse full of items and losing them all. But check out this money-making method. It's definitely going to be worth your time. Hopefully you guys enjoyed what I believe to be the top money making exploits within Red Dead Redemption 2 online. I definitely recommend that you give all of these options a try and let me know what you think about them. I would also like to know in the comments section like I was mentioning at the beginning of this video what you guys believe to be the top three money making opportunities within Red Dead Online. Now, I know that the showdown series is going to be kind of a hot topic, but if you look at specifically the money that we make every 10 to minutes or so in the showdown series, I feel like we're going to make much more money by doing some of these other money making methods. But I still want to hear if it's one of your top three. But that's all I have time for today. So if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. It would help me out a lot and is greatly appreciated. And until next time, YouTube, you guys keep doing what you're doing because you're already doing it. And you guys stay gaming.